section 23 on page 24 of your paper. It's quite late in the paper, but it is something you can do. It asks you about these tulips. There's ten bulbs, and it says seven of them are going to grow into red ones, and three are going to grow into yellow. So the chance of having a yellow one here is three out of ten. But you're going to plant the second bulb as well. So there were ten. There's now only going to be nine left. So each of these probabilities is out of nine, because there's only nine of them left there. Here, you planted a red one. There were seven red ones. There's only six left. But you've still got the three yellow ones there. Here, we're planting a yellow one. So there's only two yellow ones left. But you've still got all seven red ones. To find the probabilities on the ends, you multiply these two things together. So we're going to do 7 tenths times 6 over 9. 7 times 6 is 42. And on the bottom, we've got 9 times 10 is 90. Here, we're doing 7 times 3 is 21. The bottom's 90 again. Here, you're again doing 3 times 7. 21 out of 90. And here, you're doing 3 times 2 is 6 out of 90. The question says, find the probability that at least one will grow into a yellow one. Well, look, in this route here, you have a yellow, so we want that. In this route here, you have a yellow, so we want that. In this route here, they're both yellows, so we definitely want that. Our probability of these things added up together. So 21 and 21 is 42, plus the extra 6 makes 48 out of 90. So although that's an A grade, A sort of A grade question, it's something we can do.